Hi, I want to show you a great trick for saving a lot of time. So here's the scenario. Client sends a spreadsheet to you and says, hey, here's a list of application numbers. Which of these have been granted? And if they've been granted, what's the patent number? Well, I mean, the solution is generally this repetitive task of looking things up. And um, it can take a long time. And so wouldn't it be great if we could just do that in about a minute? So let's see if we can do it in a minute. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the spreadsheet. And in column A, I'm going to choose Copy and let's go over to a claim IP and I've got the research folder up I'll show you how to open that up just so I just clicked on the research folder icon and we're gonna choose new and we're gonna name this folder EverReady E-V-E-R-E-A-D-Y because those are mostly EverReady well in fact they're all EverReady applications and I'm gonna single click the folder see it has zero documents in it right now here's the folder and I'm gonna choose the import button and so right here I'm gonna just choose paste and import and notice that the import result box says there's 153 patents added and two not recognized. So we could just click this other tab and see which was not recognized. And those are the headers. So I think we're okay there. Looks like we got 100% of them. So now let's go into the EverReady folder and view these 153 documents. And there's a couple of things we can do. First, we have a facet that only appears when you have applications in your result list. So the facet is called application status, and it will show you whether the uh, applications are pending or granted. So here we've got 65 granted. So more than that, though, we've got a column that's called application status. So I hover my mouse, we can see it. And you notice that it says pending or granted. We have another column, which I don't have exposed, so let's click the column header and add that column by choosing the granted patent number column and it's going to put it over to the far right and I want to be able to see it so let's move it to the left of application status so notice that wherever we have a granted patent number we also have the patent number sorry wherever the application is showing granted there's a patent number and so very quickly we could determine which patent or sorry which applications have a, a grant against them but a lot of times we want to export those and so I'm going to choose export export all and granted patent number is one of the options that is selected and this looks good to me so I'm going to choose export and this takes us about one two seconds so okay so we're ready close that open up this CSV file and there is our application sorry our uh, spreadsheet showing the granted patent number and what I might want to do is just choose a data sort and sort by that published sorry not published grant date but sort by granted patent number column okay and now we can see these are all the applications that are granted and these are all the ones that are still pending very quick process hope you enjoyed the short video bye bye